We're checking out 100 of the funniest ever kids test answers, starting with this, where they have got to defend their answer. So they put answer. <laughs> and there's a little guy. And he said, Sarge, I don't know how much longer I can hold. <laughs> hey, they did what they were told. Describe what is meant by forgetting. I can't. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's brilliant. I'm going to laugh at all of these, I think. Can you draw this ship? <laughs> no. I cannot draw this ship. How do we know this angle is a right angle? Because a left angle looks like this. <laughs> oh, I'll tell you what. That handwriting looks quite mature. I'd literally be like, you cheeky little. Which is the best estimate for the length of a football? What? <laughs> To be fair, that's the right answer anyway. It is one foot, isn't it? Imagine that you lived at the same time as Abraham Lincoln. What would you say to him or ask him? I'll tell him not to go to a play ever. Oh, because he was assassinated at, when he was watching a play. So they're telling him not to... That's pretty clever. Name six animals which live specifically in the Arctic. Two polar bears, four seals. I love how they put three and they didn't... You were so smart, nearly. You're like, ah, I'm going to outsmart you, but I can't count to six. Opposites. Death, live, pro, noob. <laughs> I think the word they're looking for there is amateur. Suggest one cause of deforestation. This paper. I love how it got a tick. The teacher's like, you clever sausage. Please colour. Danish flag, Swedish flag, Finnish flag. <laughs> Look, they even put a no and double underline. Look, at they even went to the extra detail of putting some poles on it. I think they should get two ticks. Student survey, in a word, describe school. Wow. I mean, why don't you tell us what you really think? What is your favourite Hugh? <laughs> Hugh Jackman. Is that the guy who plays Wolverine? <laughs> Cause. Tony practices piano 20 minutes every day. Effect. He is a big... <laughs> Find X. Here it is. <laughs> that is, that, that's an annoying answer, isn't it? Jackie, you can't just white out a question you don't want to answer. Oh, they literally just tipexed it. <laughs> Come up with an equation that is true when X equals seven. Be creative. You can make the equation as simple or as complex as you want. X equals seven. <laughs> You did say make it as simple or as complex as you want. That's actually stupid. Explain the phrase free press when your mum irons trousers for you. <laughs> the table feels the downward push of your hand. What do you feel? Scared that the table has feelings. <laughs> I'm so sorry, table. I'm so sorry. <laughs> How did you solve problem eight? How I solved problem eight is I thought about it. <laughs> But it's kind of true. The first cells were probably... <laughs> oh, they got number nine wrong as well. What is chemosynthesis? Do you know what chemosynthesis is? I flipping don't know what that is. Find the difference between eight and six. Eight is all curly, six is not. Well, technically, you tried being smart, but six is pretty curly too. They're probably about five years old, so I think we can let them off on that one, can't we? In your opinion, which location would be the most dangerous during a tornado? circle one it is way too dangerous to circle a tornado i mean fair enough what is the strongest force on earth love <laughs> that's well i think it is honestly think it might be what do you reckon i think love's a great answer i think my mum should do less of this Oh, no. Oh, my days. When her mum sees that, she's going to be horrified. When I grow up, I want to be a dog. <laughs> to change centimetres to metres, you take out cent... <laughs> I'm good. I like how kids take questions so literally. It's actually quite a skill to take them that literally. I, I, I respect it. A pig is a pig until it becomes... Baker. Oh, my days. It's true. It's reality, but... I didn't know they'd know that at that age. Briefly explain what hard water is. <laughs> you can't complain at that. That's a tick in my book. Get a point. Ten words I can spell right are... Ten words I can spell right are octopus seven two. Wait, is octopus spelled right? Draw a picture of what you will look like in a hundred years. Oh my God, is that a tombstone? Where have you smelled burned fat before? At the gym. 
<laughs> what test at school? Ask that question. Motivate your answer. Go answer, go. I don't even understand the actual question. Motivate your answer. I don't get the question. The cookie recipe called for one cup of butter, four cups of flour. Oh my God, I'm lost again. Explain how Sarah could still make the cookies without going to the store or borrowing from a neighbor. Steal. I love it. Nothing else. Just one word. Steal. Expand A plus B. Oh my God. They've literally just put the gaps in between. This boy is sad, glad, or ugly. Enough is enough, Judy. Judy, okay. Stop being so mean. A coin is flipped and then a die is rolled. What is the probability of a rolling an odd and then flipping a tails? Zero percent because you flip the coin first. Now that is how you spot a genius, my friends. How did you figure it out? Show your workings. I could with my fingers. That counts. Duh, duh, duh. That's fair. I mean, whatever works. What is a six-sided polygon known as? A stop sign. Okay, that's pretty clever. Do you know what six-sided polygon is known? Come on. Come on. You don't know, do you? Uh, so we've got a very confusing equation. Oh my God, my brain hurts looking at it. Jesus is always the answer. Minus five. They got minus five points for that. Wow. Not on this question. <laughs> In the space below, please write any overall comments about this course or instructor not covered above. If I had one hour to live, I'd spend it in this class because it feels like an eternity. Wow! What is the importance of timing and decision making? I don't know. I'll tell you tomorrow. But they have very successfully answered the question. It made you think, didn't it? Well, I remember that squared paper from school. It was really, really cool, wasn't it? It could draw amazing shapes. The walrus has lost its home due to global warming and has chosen to reside in my math. That's a really good drawing of a walrus. I couldn't draw a walrus better than that. I love my mum because she gives me toilet paper when it runs out. That is one of many reasons we love our parents, you know? They are there for us through thick and thin, <laughs> no matter what. What is love? Baby, don't hurt me. Don't hurt me no more. What is love? Baby, don't hurt me. I can't believe they wrote lyrics of a song. That song is really old. So how old is that test answer? Civilization, monarchy. Okay, this is a spelling thing. They've got most of them wrong. Illiterate, they haven't. <laughs> because illiterate would mean they can't spell. <sighs> what are three things you want to do in the future? Get a girlfriend, respectable. Kiss her, rule the world. I love it how they have kept their dreams very small scale you know just just the world not the universe they want to go too far they're like just the world <laughs> mel sees a raft a boat and a ship on the water they're all carrying people which holds the least fart that's something like my son would write on his test answer just fart for everything what's your name fart i've got a question for you and let's see if you can answer it have you liked the video have you subscribed to the channel I hope the answer is both the yes. If you can't subscribe to the channel for any reason, don't worry about it. It's still a legend as well. Geometry, shape, name these 2D shapes. J, Char Charlie, Sophia. <laughs> oh, those names suit those shapes. Well done. Brandon saw 17 blue cars and 25 green cars. My, okay, my brain's gone again. At the toy store. How many cars did he see? Explain your answer. I got the answer by talking in my brain and I agreed with the answer that my brain got. Uh, sounds like they might have two personalities. Describe how the trans transformer works <laughs> this is like an electricity exam and they've drawn a car they've drawn a robot that is so good describe the shape and structure of the milky way it's kind of like a long bumpy rectangle it's completely covered in milk chocolate but inside there are two delicious layers chocolatey nugget and caramel is it caramel and i don't think that a milky way chocolate bar has caramel mate i think you actually got that wrong i'll give you a cross for that circle the smallest number well then it's not wrong. Should have done it A, B, C, shouldn't you? Yeah? They've just outsmarted you on your own test. Where was the American Declaration of Independence signed? At the bottom. <laughs> yes! I have got a lot of respect for that. Explain the steps you would take to find the number of centimeters in one kilometer. Google it. Now that is the reality of the world we live in these days, isn't it? Where would we be without Google? What do you dislike about high school? People. Oh, okay. Um, uh, I, I mean, it's an honest answer at least. Use a strategy you have learned. Tony buys one dozen roses. Half of them are red. How many of the roses are not red? Half of the roses are not red. That is absolutely bang on, right? Whether they're less than or greater than. 
<laughs> yeah, because they're saying you can pick right or. So they've just put or in between. My dog is a circle because he is round. <laughs> Your yeah, menace ain't hero, companion, or worker. That dog is really ranked. I can jump. I can run. I can play in the sun. I can swim. I can skate. I can break a cake. Oh, I can bake a cake. I can pee. He can pee. I think that, that makes sense. Date me, please. Oh, my. <laughs> I have zero dollars. I need two million. Two billion dollars. <laughs> 1 over n sin x equals question mark. Wait, wait, <laughs> wait, 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 wait. They've cancelled out the two n's on the same side of the equation. <laughs> that is actually genius. Describe the chemical differences between H2O and CO2. H2O is hot water, CO2 is cold water. Oh my God. Is that because of the H and the C? <laughs> Short answer. The difference between the Feb revolution and the October revolution is that one occurred in Feb and one occurred in October. Zero out of ten. I love that. The cheeky little comment. Good try, though. So for a good try, surely you get more than a zero out of ten. Why do we pay taxes so we don't get arrested? I mean, they're kind of right. <laughs> none of us want to get arrested. And none of us want to pay taxes. Positive ways our family handles stress. Suck it up. <laughs> you know what? <laughs> Sometimes that can be it. If you've got stuff to get done and you're stressed out, sometimes you just gotta go and get it done. If A squared over B squared is the answer, what is the question? Please write A squared over B squared. <laughs> that is correct. They haven't got a question mark though. I'd only give them a half a point because he didn't put the question mark. Saturn, Uranus, and Neptune have at least three things in common. List them. They all are planets. They are all round. None of them have much. <laughs> How many days are in a week? Seven. How many months are in a year? Twelve. Is this number even or odd? Sixty-eight. Even. How do you know? Because I'm smart. <laughs> oh wait, what's the teacher in? Because the number in the ones place is even. I prefer the first answer, I'm not gonna lie. What did you learn about Earth Day that you did not already know? In what situation might this new information be useful? I did not know Earth Day was in April 22. It might be useful in a trivia game. <laughs> uh, again, it's actually right. You know, it's not, it's not a wrong answer. Would you want to swim with the boy in this water? No, because there's trash in the water. You can't say that. You can't go body shaming him. Like, how do you even tell? He's just got a rubber duck around him. What is the highest frequency noise that a human can register? <laughs> Sorry, I may have just smashed a few windows in your house or made you never want to open your ears again. Draw a plant cell and identify its most important parts. Have they really drawn a flower like a plant in jail? <laughs> Iron bars and no windows. <laughs> oh, I love it. What ended in 1896? <laughs> well. Oh, technically it didn't end in 1896 it ended at exactly the same time that 1896 began so technically you're actually wrong mate guy davy bones to his treasure oh i love that i absolutely love it that is a bit stupid of the people who've drawn that map they've just left a massive gap that is a genius test what will you be doing when you're 100 years old breaking out of my tomb oh wow Parent signature. Oh, they haven't faked their mum's signature at all, have they? <laughs> oh, no, that is so, that is, that's so bad. If I'm late for class, I will burst into class and comment on Mr. Thomas' moustache. Mr. Thomas will blush and say thanks. Don't think that was what they were expecting. What do you think is the best solution to overpopulation? Support your argument with examples. The Hunger King. <laughs> uh. <laughs> Who would not want to grade this paper? Do not touch is snot. It fell from my nose. <laughs> that is absolutely rank. Why are there rings on Saturn? Because God liked it, so he put a ring on it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the teacher! Saturn was not a single lady. Oh, I hope you all know the Beyonce song. Surely you do. Rachel has 16 chocolate bars. Tracy takes four from her and asks for the remaining quarter. What would she end up with? A slap. You know what? I must agree. There's some things you don't touch of somebody else's. Well, this is confusing. This ninja protects question nine from being marked as incorrect. <laughs>
Can you draw a magical mushroom? Yes. <laughs> Straight to the point. Factual. It never said, please draw one. It just said, can you? Yes, I can draw one. Draw a clock. It's a quarter to four. Draw the hands. <laughs> They've taken that way too literally, haven't they? <laughs> just <a> little... <laughs> oh, hey, they got the time right, though. Respect. How old is your grandfather? Fill in the solutions. Problems. You fell on the playground and scratched your knee. Solutions. Get up and deal with it. That is the way forward. Get up, deal with it. When I grow up, I would like to be... We've got lots of people answering. Very nice handwriting with lots of colour. If we go down to Albert, he wants to be a person who stays home and does nothing. Yeah, you might want to work on your ambitions there, buddy. Write an example of a risk. This. <laughs> That's true though. That is just, honestly, that's genius level kind of stuff that. Thinking outside of the box. Would you rather be stuck on an island all alone or with one person you hate? I would rather be on island with someone I hate so I have something to eat. That's not worrying at all, is it? The diagram below best illustrates giraffes are heartless creatures. Why? Wait, they just let one. Yeah, that's pretty mean. One of them is just killed over and they've just ignored him. They're just eating lunch still. Bobby has four dimes. Amy has 30 pennies. Which child has more money? Bobby, tick. How do you know? Show your thinking. <laughs> Why sad face? Is that like your thinking phase, uh, Bobby? I am Alina. I like to listen. I like to make pictures. I like writing. I like free choice. I learn to count to 100. When I grow up, I want to be a customer in a store. I will buy broccoli, tomatoes, and carrots. When I get home, I will make soup. I'm actually lost for words. How do you make a marriage work? Tell your wife she looks pretty. Ah, oh, even if she looks like a dump truck. <laughs> oh, that's tickled me that. Okay. <laughs> the difference between 180 and 158 is 22. Well done. Explain how you found out your answer in problem four. Math. <laughs> Marion Schubert asks area kindergartners, what would you do if you were the ruler of the world? I would destroy it from outer space. That's kind of scary. Write the two reactions used in the separation of CaCO3. What? Reaction one, to dissolve the CaCO3. Surprised. Reaction two, to form the astonished. I think they were talking about what chemical reactions do you have to do? I think. I don't know what CaCO3 is, but they would probably be my reaction. Surprised, so don't know what it is. And astonished, because again, I don't know what it is. That was 100 of the funniest ever kids test answers. Don't forget to drop a like and subscribe if you can. It helps a lot and you're going to want to watch something else. That is what you want to watch.